Hey a beautiful people I'm so happy that you are here listening and watching to my video and in this video I'm going to teach you how to paint a beautiful and simple landscape for beginners using soft shades and also I'm going to include some birds layouts so please do watch the video till the end and also hit the thumbs up if you like this video If you like my content and want to see more do subscribe and also press the notification bell so you'll be notified to check on what is new So coming to the materials required you will need some paints a masking tape mixing plate brushes and a watercolor sheet The paper that I'm going to use for today's painting is going to be an Indian branded and it is buffered perforated sheet you can see how textured they are they are not smooth but they are textured and they are of 300 gsm with rough finish and it is half weight coming to the masking tape the masking tape that i am going to use today is this normal cello tape uh this cello tape is not good for watercolors but since this is being a gouache day i'm going to use this normal cello tape because gouache has this very thick consistency and like watercolors so gouache are very good to go with this masking tape and i have uh, masked it down all around all the sides of my paper and i have squeezed a little amount of paint onto my palette i'm going to mix it with some white and i'm going to stroke it on my paper Also if you recreate my paintings please do tag me or DM me so I can feature them on my Instagram stories or also in my YouTube channel Now sit back and enjoy the video and if you are interested or inspired already go get your paints and brushes and paint today Now the color that I've used for the painting is some flesh tint along with the color that I've used already plus some white and I'm going to stroke it upwards so that it will go and meet it in the midway and create this very beautiful gradient effect and gives a very soft effect to the painting. And coming to the gouache, gouache requires a little more time for blending because they are very thick in consistency and also If you find any lines or strikes in between just try to blend it out with your brush or add some water with some paint so that it will be very easy for you to blend because only if you blend the paints properly the beauty of the gouache will pop out and also bring this soft effect onto the paper right now i'm going to add this pretty little moon at the corner of the sheet Okay guys now let's paint some beautiful birds layouts so you just need one dot for head and one dot for body actually a big dot for a body and a line for a tail also a little triangle for a beak
yes guys now using splattering technique i am going to scatter some stars on the painting and also guys if you haven't checked out my 12 basic watercolor techniques for beginners the link is down in the description box below so do go watch and learn something new today Yes guys, you are finally done with the painting. I hope you really enjoy this video and learn something new out of it. So if you like this video, please do give it a big thumbs up. And also if you are new here, do subscribe and press the notification bell. Happy painting. God bless you.